Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to show you how to attach a file on Wix. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time on Wix, I want you to click the sign up option. And from here, just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go. Attaching a file to your Wix website is a straightforward process and is a great way to allow visitors to download resources such as PDFs, documents, images, or other files. Now, once you are logged into your account, I want you to click on the site that would direct you to the website editor. Here, all you have to do is hover to the left side panel of your dashboard and there's going to be an add elements we're in. You might want to put in something like, for example, a theme buttons, like a download. All you have to do is click on, uh, drag it here. All right. Now the uh, drag button right here, you can customize all of it. For example, if you wanted to change the layout, text only, left, right, center, and all of that. You can change the design. You can put in something like um if you want to custom design i'm gonna click on the downloads all right now on the animation for example i'm gonna put in something like a, a, a turn and you can put in the link now the link for here you can put in the web address if you wanted or maybe a document in the document you can choose a file all right for example i'm gonna put in the a, a file like a, a like our logo all right you can add that or add this page that's also here all right by clicking done you have already attached a file on wix now the idea is that attaching files here on wix is a straightforward process whether through a download button or you can add in a link text right here there's a lot that you can work with Wix provides, as you can see, link. All right, I'm gonna put in the web address. Similarly, go to documents, choose a file, depending on your needs, like downloads or embedding. Right, it provides flexibility to handle file attachments easily. And again, if you have a specific type of file, all you have to do is go to the add elements and put the file here. It's a very easy thing to do in a straightforward process that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one